Hey everyone, welcome back to Keeping Up with the Chaldeans. This is a new segment on, on Keeping Up with the Chaldeans. It's called Doug's Corner. Uh, Doug's going to share uh, monthly deals with, with you on uh, leases or buys, purchases. purchases. Uh, today he's going to talk a little bit about uh, if, is, is it better to lease or to buy. So hey Doug. Yeah, thank welcome, you. To you? Well, welcome, welcome to your show. Welcome to your show. First and foremost, first. hold on. First and foremost, okay. happy birthday to happy this man. Birthday. Yeah. Happy, happy birthday, dear Doug. Yeah. Yeah. Happy birthday, dear Doug. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. So happy cool. birthday. We'll brother. talk about the age later. Yes. yes. All right. Now, uh, one of the biggest questions I get is: it better to lease or buy a car when you put on a lot of miles? And so, in Michigan, it's much better to lease. And I'll tell you why: because most of the cars have a. Um, 60% residual. So that means during the lease period, you pay for 40% of the car plus tax. And if you purchase, you pay for 100% of the car plus tax. So if you have it for three years, you pay 40% of it. Then you release a vehicle. Now you're up to six years and you've paid 80% of the vehicle. Mm. Um, how many people really keep their car more than, than six years? And in today's market, what's a car worth in six years? Um, the used car market is on the wholesale side when you turn it in, um, you, you barely get anything for it. And um, today with, with the car facts, if you get in an accident with your car and take it to the dealership or one of our Chaldean um, bump shops and they fix it to be to spec, 100% perfect. Um, you can you can expect to lose minimum of twenty percent of the value just because it's been in an accident um, without any frame damage or anything like that. Um, I've seen it even when somebody lost a bumper from a rock, <laughs> and we had to fight for him to get the full value of this vehicle. Wow. So is it is it true about once the car leaves the lot, it depreciates by an X amount? Oh yeah, everything um, it depreciates almost immediately. And, um, you know, for Michigan, we don't have mass transit. Yes. So you really can't go without a car. Right. And I see most of the homes have three and four vehicles. Mm -hmm. So anyone out there looking for a, a, to a new vehicle, make sure you call Doug. Uh, Doug, why don't you tell us a little bit about what kind of deals are going on this month? Okay, for um, this month, for a smaller vehicle, the um, Jeep Compass has the biggest rebates. And for a limited compass, which has leather seats, remote start, heated seats, um, the backup camera, everything in it except a sunroof, even navigation, it's about two twenty to two thirty a month. Wow. And um, for a mid-size vehicle, um, the best buy this month is the Ford Explorer. Um, I have two of them right now that are demos with leather seats, uh, basically loaded. Um, Again, no sunroof for three fifty a month. Mm. Still, that's great. It's oh, yeah. a great price. You know, yeah. it's usually near five hundred. Right. And for a large vehicle, the best best purchase out there, or lease, I should say, out there, is the Cadillac XT6. That's the new one that seats seven people. Mm -hmm. And last month, the same vehicle was about six forty six a month. Um, this month is about five fifty. Right. Well, it's a big saving. That's over $1,200 yeah. for the year, right? About right. $1, and you said year. seat seven? Yeah, seat seven. Three, <clears throat> in, three in the back, then two captain chairs, and then the two oh, up front. That's a big one. Yeah. Nice. 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 It's a brand new one that just came out. It's bigger than the XT5, but it's not as big as the Escalade. That's not what we're looking at. No, 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 no. That's, that's the Escalade. That's what I was going to get into. Do you want to get into that? Because obviously a lot of our consumers drive that. So Yeah, and um, if, if your lease is coming up soon, Give me a call. What's soon? What does soon mean? Well, I mean this year. So, yeah, so and, any four, three months, five yeah, months? Yeah, three, within six months. Within six months, okay. Um, give me a call and I'll help you extend your lease because you don't want to lease um, an older Escalade mm -hmm. when the new one's coming out in just a few months. Right. And the price that they're leasing Escalades today is not going to be much different than the price of, of the, the new, new one, one that's coming out. So, um, and then you have Escalade up there, you have Tahoe up there, and you have and UConn, UConn up there. Right. And we're what? taking deposits, and then you, I'll help you build your car so you get the colors you want, uh -huh. the options you want, and you don't have to put options that you don't need because 
everything you add in there, there's cost. a cost. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Nice, nice. So anything else that we want to give to these viewers right now? Uh, no, and also the Corvettes, you know, those are coming out very soon. Yeah. Um, next year, this year, they're only coming out with the, the 400 horsepower. And then next year, they're going to be coming out with the 700 and 800 horsepower vehicles. That's Jeez. it? <laughs> yeah. yeah, it was just but the But you got to get from point A to point B, B. quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, know, yeah, Anthony, no. back in his heydays, used to run about as fast as that 700 horsepower. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, right. running? Yeah, yeah, you see him play softball. He hit it and yeah. cracked it out the park and run. Well, that's uh, that's our segment, first segment of uh, Doug's Corners. Doug's Corner. Yeah. Doug's Corner. And if you'd like to give me a call, I'll answer your questions. If you do business with me or not, mm -hmm. my number is 248 258 3900 or even better my cell phone number 248 761 7600 and obviously you've been looking at that phone number the whole time so the phone number's down there anyway yep and you guys be able to reach out to him seems like he's got a bunch of good opportunities for you to get into the smaller cars mm -hmm. some of the garages aren't even fitting the larger cars these days yeah right so you guys jump on that from 200 on up he's able to take care of you this is the man, Doug Soroki. You and can even email him at SorokiDoug at gmail.com if you don't want to call. And look for this uh, segment every single month, guys. Yep. Either the first Tuesday or Thursday of the month. Yep. Thank you. Thank Thanks. You. Signing off.